Let's get started. Let's take a spin around this car and let's see if our decision on wheels has paid off. Paving the direction forward for this build. Let's get out here and take a look. Today is a big day. We have wheels, we have tires. I've been waiting for these for a couple of weeks. They've freshly been cut, freshly been ceramic coated, and really set the pace for the tone of the build. This is going to be one of those foundation pieces that's really going to set the path forward for not only the cosmetic aspect of our build that we're going to be doing on this 2022 Mustang GT, but performance. Get ready for what's coming. Big thing. So make sure that you are subscribed to this channel. This is this is really exciting. So this is right off the bat. This is my third time dealing with variant wheels. What we're going to put on this Mustang is definitely a YouTube first. I have not seen any other S550s with this wheel combination because it is a new 2023 wheel drop okay so it's new now we did this same wheel on the super that we had and i fell in love with it it was it's like one of my most favorite designs out there amongst all the different brands okay and now before you skip forward before we even unbox and go any further in this video hear me out real quick i want to be able to save you guys some money and and clue you in on some free stuff, how you can get free stuff. Always check out the video description, the links down below to save a bunch of money on whatever products, suspension, go fast parts, wheels, tires, which we're about to cover. Go to variantwheels.com, follow the links down in the description or go to their website and use promo code Xander13 at checkout because what you're gonna get is biggest savings that you can get bar none online period dot. They have cold forge options, full forged, I mean, literally, the sky is the limit, all made right here in the good old United States of America. They do custom offsets if you want something crazy, crazy colors. But also, if you use that promo code, you're also going to get a free ceramic coating. It's like a three or $400 value just for using the promo code Xander13 at checkout for free. You're also going to get wheel cleaner for free, okay? Free shipping. That's like another $250 of savings right there. And you're also going to get a free three-year road hazard warranty. If you bend it, break it, curb it, it's a free replacement for three years. That is an industry first only at Variant Wheels. Again, follow the links down below in the description. I think that you will like all of the different selection that they have. All right, so behind us, we've got, let's we'll start with the tires. All right, so let's start with tires. Obviously got a 265, 35, 20. We're going 20s on this car because it has factor 20s anyway. And then we're obviously doing a 305 in the back. 305, 35, 20. And we're doing a Nitto 555 G2 front. And we're on the same combination a couple of times and it's really good at holding big power because 305, 35, 20, 555 R2s. This is a drag radial that's been pretty good to me in the past. You know, whenever we've run them, pretty good in the rain, pretty quiet tire and it hooks up and it will hold 700 plus horsepower very, very well on the street and very respectable on the track as well. Anyway, so we got our meat, but we have our new variant wheels. We're about to, so we're gonna unbox one of these. And the plan is we're gonna strip the car. We're gonna put this thing all the way up on four jack stands. We're gonna load up a truck and which we haven't revealed on the channel just yet. Uh, so stay tuned because we have some goodies for that thing as well. If you're into F-150 stuff, but we're gonna put this thing in the air, pull the wheels off. We're gonna load all this in the truck. We're gonna go to our friends at Discount Tire. We're gonna have a mount balance, do all the TPMS sensors, all that stuff. We're gonna come back, put them on the car, see how good they look. Do a walk around at the end of this video. And I think that you'll be highly impressed. This is a semi-gloss black coating, helium from Variant. All right, let's open them up. Let's see what they look like. Let's go. This is a 20 by 10, 20 by 11 staggered fitment. And it's gonna look perfect. So very nice packaging, as always. All right, so first up we have hub rings. These are gonna keep things centered on the hub. Yeah, that's what they look like right here. All right, and now, spin them around. This is gonna be our first time together. Looking at these, I have not cheated. This is the first time, oh my gosh, yes. I love, love the heliums. 
Look at that. All right, so this is what we're replacing. This is an upgraded option from Ford. They don't look terrible on the Oxford White. Okay, this is nice, but it's not that. This is so sexy. This is so sick. All right, so I talked about different finishes and wheel cap options and stuff like that. Check this out. This is white. This, they have put white lettering on for the VA here. We want it to stand out and kind of match the car. So this is something that you can do when you order your set is you can do different colors on the entire center cap or leave them black or whatever you want to do, but they have different colored options for the VA logo here. That is the variant helium. Again, this is new for 2023. We ran them on the Supra. I loved it. We're going to run them on the Mustang, and oh my goodness. All right, for science, before we move on, let's weigh them. I am like 185 pounds, and I'm going to step on the scale fully dressed, and we're just going to get the weight, and then I'm going to pick this up, hold it, and we'll go from there and subtract the weight and do that kind of math. Anyway, let's give it a shot. All for science, right? So fully dressed, 190... 2.6, 192.6, all right, remember that number. Let's grab our new, this is so light. Look, this is so freaking awesome. All right, let's hold it up, right to my center of my chest. 192.6, now with me holding the wheel, 220 on the dot. All right, so 196, no, I'm sorry, 192.6, Versus 220 on the dot. Let's do some math because I suck at it. Equals 28, so it'll be 28.6 pounds. So pretty lightweight for a aftermarket wheel that is that big. It's a 20 by 11. All right, so hours later, we finally are back, and it's time to mount some wheels and tires. Let's get to it. We're gonna need to put on uh, these little hub rings, right? Okay, so simple as just sliding them on like that. And this just kind of helps center things up. Uh, these will come with every wheel kit that you get, so you don't have to spend money on them. But uh, anyway, so, all right, we got those. We got our stock wheels, and then we got the new hotness. Look at the concavity of these bad boys, guys. All right, let's throw them on the car. Let's see what they look like. beautiful weather out here so now is the time of the video we're gonna get out here and take a look at the car in the sunlight let's get started let's take a spin around this car and let's see if our decision on wheels has paid off paving the direction forward for this build let's get out here and take a look all right guys no fancy b-roll no cinematography nothing special like that we're getting right to the meat and potatoes of how this looks so here we go this is the helium from variant wheels guys go check them out on the website like i said use promo code zanda 13 to save a ton of money like the best savings online period dot and free ceramic coating which these have and it kind of gives it a nice little like extra sheen and easier to clean as well plus free wheel cleaner free shipping and free three-year road hazard warranty so if you bend one break one crack one they got you covered for three years, and I think it's 50% after that. Uh, don't quote me, but anyway, all the details are on the website, but this is a fantastic looking wheel, and I think it really fits the theme overall for the direction forward. Remember in the last video or so, we talked about like maybe doing the calipers in different colors, so now we can see what the wheels look like with the tent, and we're still gonna do some uh, maybe graphics on the car somewhere, but I want the calipers to maybe shine through the brakes a little bit. I'm thinking red, but maybe Maybe a blue or something like that so let me know in the comments like what do you think but let's take a closer look at these because these things are killer and they have some crazy concave so this is a 20 by 10 20 by 11 staggered fitment and I was wrong in the beginning I think I already plugged it in but it's a 275 35 20 and then of course we have the 305 35 
20 in the rear with the uh, the Nitto R2s. So we're running a drag radial in the rear. I should tell you that power is going to be coming to this car. So definitely stay tuned for that. Anyway, this is a really sophisticated, aggressive looking wheel. Forgive the uh, the tire place has still got their, their sludge all around. I tried to get it all off, but it's really shining in the uh, daylight. But anyway, I like the center caps. So we did white center cap logos there, and I think it really looks good with the paint, which is cool because you can have those color match to your car, or you can be different. Uh, the sky's the limit, honestly. But let's show you the concave real quick. Let's see if I can get my shadow out of the way. So I took a tape measure, um, I put it all the way into the center cap and then measured off of the rim of the wheel and they each go in on the Mustang Fitment about three inches. So on camera, hopefully it's gonna pick it up, but they're pretty deep. They are pretty deep. The rear is so sexy, so wide. Yes, sir. This is it. Uh, as far as I can't remember, I'll have to plug it in the video, the offset, but they are dead nuts flush with the tire selection and the offset that we went with. I'll show you the front real quick. So, dead, 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 dead flush, which is exactly what you want when you're buying aftermarket wheels. Sometimes you spend money on your fancy wheels and then you just don't quite get there. But Variant Wheels, again, my third time working with them and they've nailed it every single time. Every single time. Their customer service is absolutely insane. We've got the front splitter. Remember we also did the GT500 style rear valance. We got exhaust in the garage ready to put on this thing. But yeah, that 305 Fitment beefy in a way it's kind of almost like simple in design but it gets the job done so well i mean I, I love this is my second time with the heliums we had them on the supra now we're back in a mustang where i should be i think you guys will all agree as well but i think that these are like my favorite that they offer again one more time look at the front yeah, let me know in the comments. What do you think about this? This is these are so classy. So you know the, the whole stormtrooper look going on, but the semi-gloss black, ceramic coated, really catches the light really well in person. Hopefully coming off a of camera like I really hope it does, but they look really, really good and poppy in person, but so aggressive. That's it. This is it. I am in love. So, yep, and we're going to get it lowered too, so don't worry, with help from our friends at BMR Suspension. Anyway, guys, that's the video. So, again, let me know what you think about the wheels in the comments down below. But that's the video, guys. So, God bless all of you. Take care. Have a great day. I'll see you guys in the next video. Get ready for more mods, and we got to do some other driving around, some talking, some stuff like that. Regular content is coming your way very, very soon. I'll see you guys later. Bye.